Okay, let's look at this random problem from AP Precalculus section 1.4. A polynomial function increases from negative infinity to 1, that's an interval, and decreases from 1 to infinity, which the following must occur. So this is not that bad of a problem at all. So if I had a coordinate plane, right, I'm just going to draw this out because this problem won't take much longer. At 1, I have some polynomial. All I know, I don't know what it looks like, but all I know is it's increasing. And then once it hits 1, it starts decreasing. And I don't know what it looks like, and I'm purposely making it look bad. So it's asking what must happen between 0 and 2. So here's 0, and here's 2. What must happen is I'm going to have a maximum. So what must happen? Uh, I mean, I am going to have a y-intercept. Actually, no, I guess I don't have to have a y-intercept. Technically, I could start this way down here. So I don't need to have a y-intercept. I don't need an x-intercept. Even the picture that I drew doesn't have one. It's not going to have a local minimum, but what it must have is a local maximum. Basically, there's a rule that says if you go from increasing to decreasing, right, you're going to have a local maximum no matter what. I drew it out just to drive home the point. <laughs> it's a point. Get it? Uh, like and subscribe.